I am a storyteller. This idea of telling and receiving stories is, is a huge part of who I am. I come from three generations of, of people in the performing arts and maybe it had, it had a profound influence on my thinking. But that, but that real passion comes from, from my own core. It comes from me wanting to, to share or be part of stories. My message and my access or my way of portraying the character will always be how human can I make him? If there was you know, one reason why I do it, that's why I do it. Because it helps me see different perspectives. Relax. The bow and arrow once was the pinnacle of weapons technology. It allowed the great Genghis Khan to rule from the Pacific to the Ukraine, an empire twice the size of Alexander the Great and four times the size of the Roman Empire. But today, whoever holds the latest stark weapons rules these lands. And soon, it'll be my turn. I think if we look at people from that perspective, it's easier to access and identify with people. We can put whatever frame you want to put around it. But it's the honesty of that, that that's, where, that's what makes us identify with the person's pain or joy or whatever. And that to me is a very powerful thing. to remove responsible things to close you back up. I don't close me up. If you get in, if it's too complicated, cut the cord. Paralyze me if you must. I survived the war, did you know that? No. I survived the war where they put bodies into mass graves where there's once a playground. I survived the death of my family, my parents, my brothers and sisters. Then I survived the death of my wife and child when they starved to death in a refugee camp. I survived the loss of my country, of hearing my mother tongue spoken, of knowing what it feels like to have a place to call home. I survived, and I will survive the loss of my legs. If I have to, I'll survive it. Every character that I play is going to refract through this prism, which is me, being male, that prism is being a father, that prism is being a Muslim, that prism is coming from a Pakistani culture, that prism is also being an American. It's, it's all of that. If through that channel somebody is then therefore, you know, um, thinking about issues, then I think then, then that's a beautiful thing. That's a beautiful thing. And to be able to do that, it's worth everything. The great thing about art is that it might not give you solutions, but it gives you, it provokes questions. Hello. My commander requests the presence of your captain in order to negotiate a ceasefire. You will come aboard our ship via shuttlecraft. Your refusal would be unwise.
walk with me. If I don't report in 15 minutes, evacuate the crew. Sir, we can There issue. is no help for us out here. Use autopilot. And get off this ship. Hi, Captain. You're captain now, Mr. Kirk. I don't care if, if, if I can present solutions. I do want to invoke and provoke questions. I will do it until the day I die. It is the only thing that, that, that makes me who I am. That's my world.